Now at any point in time when we're working on this project, you can go ahead and you can save this project. Okay, That's something that you can do is, is you can actually go to your file and you could save the project. Now that's great, but that doesn't save you as a movie. What we really want to do is save this as a movie file. Now we got two routes that we can go. So you can see I did it from the drop-down menu, went to save movie. Or we can go into save movie from here, and there's some different settings that we can choose. Okay. So now if I want to save this, typically what I like to do is I just I usually save it for a computer. Okay. Um, or you can always choose what's best recommended for this project. Okay. Um, so there are some other settings. But you know you're you're pretty good going with just whatever's recommended. Um, you can see that this is going to save as a Windows Media file type, and I'm going to call this then my um, example. Okay, and I'm just going to click on save. And what this is doing now is this actually goes through a rendering process. So it takes all of these clips, everything that we put together, and it actually puts them into one package and that's what a movie is. is a movie is a package of all these clips so that's going to be done here in just a little bit and then we'll be able to watch our movie on media player okay and so now it's finished it says it's done now we can go ahead and we can open this up and play this in media player okay which is different than looking at it in um, the regular group. But there you can go. Let's see, there's my video. Okay. And hopefully you got your video done as well and saved and then we're ready to go um, to the web or to wherever it is that we want to share this.